uh, maybe after then I started hearing. Oh yeah, that's maybe three years. That's three years. Yeah, yeah, three years. This okay. game's so old. I don't know. Twenty. Thinking old game. Put it over. Sixteen. Oh, I mean, <laughs> 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 but speaking of the old days, uh, he used to play Forsberg. Yeah. There's a chance that I don't know how much he keeps up with him, like warms him up. Right. But he has seemed to switch to. to do you like that completely. matchup, like Forsberg versus Orkane? Is that why you brought that Forsberg up? Forsberg versus Orkane. Yeah. Or are you oh. just saying he could do it? Um, I was just saying he could do it, but that's okay. a great point. Forsberg kind of bodies Orkane. Okay. I don't. I, I actually <laughs> had no idea. Well, at least that that used to be a, the, the very strong opinion, I feel like, dominant okay. opinion. But okay. it could be different now, because I mean, Zaro does really Zaro well. We have seen Zaro beat Cake at every tournament. Yeah, yeah. so, I mean, exactly. They, maybe they played every tournament, two tournaments. But yeah, sure. Yeah. Sure, sure, sure. Maybe it was, it's rare to see Cake lose, so, like, yeah. Here we go. Starting again on town, Tower of Heaven, make it, keeping me as a liar, making me look dumb, <laughs> saying that not many people start here. It's Battlefield. It's Battlefield, you're right. Yeah, the, I agree, though. Normally, I think it was out of favor for a while. A lot of people like Oof. to start on um, Merchant Port or even the uh, Missile Gates. Yeah. Imperial Gates. Oh, interesting. Wanted to get out of the corner. Said, yeah. oh, I can let you get into this over here. Hopping around. Pretty cool. Yeah. Sylvanas, all our heavies are super fast, <laughs> which is pretty fun when you compare it to other games. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, get, misses the tech chase. And that's what will happen to Sylvanas. You, you miss one tech chase, like, yeah, sure, you can cover tech in place and tech out you know, pretty well if he spaces it. But if he messes up even slightly, especially on the tech in place, oh my gosh. The Tots gets him killed. My dude. Oh <laughs> my gosh. He the deserved bracket, it. Let's man. go, Starvos. Uh. And <laughs> Starvos has no one to sleep on. Not at all. For sure. Yeah, I didn't mean earlier when I said up and coming. Like, I didn't mean Starbucks is a new player. Okay, but then I me. think he has been improving. He's been improving personally recently. a lot. Yeah. yeah, I understand that. Yeah. Yeah. So neither of these players are super new. But, yeah, I agree, I agree. But they're both. Uh, doing well lately. Yeah, a lot of people co compare these two characters too, right? Like when Sylvanas first came out, right. they're like, oh, Sylvanas is just like it's longer bigger Orcane. Orcane. <laughs> yeah, big, longer Orcane. <laughs> um, and that's true to some extent, especially you'll see it in like the, the tech chase manner, but it, it, it kind of stops there, I'd say. Oh, yeah. man. Good conversion, catches right the eye in. Popping him up. One of the few characters you feel pretty confident using the up strong uh, Normally Orcanes are a little Beautiful. hesitant to use it. I love that conversion. Putting him up with the up tilt, dragging him down from there, down strong. He hated that flower. Yeah. <laughs> he F smashed the one, then he up the other. Yeah, he's allergic. <laughs> I cannot deal. And what do you do? How do you kill flowers? You put water on them. <laughs> <laughs> Too much water. Overwatering is real. <laughs> oh, man. I feel like this has been the story of this game. The combo. Is that I feel like Ryze win winning neutral a lot the majority of the time, but when Starbos does, he's getting a lot more out of it. Yeah, he gets like 40 each time. Yeah, and that's because, you know, I mean, either Rod's missing his stuff, you could say, or, um, you know, Star... Oh, my oh. goodness. Or Kane has an easier time hitting such a large target. Yeah, that's totally fair. Oh, my goodness. He's, he does, he's like, I'm going to do a less laggy <laughs> Less taunt. dangerous taunt, and he still wow. throws out a... Yeah. Yeah, that's really impressive. Like, Starbos is seems prepared for this matchup. I just noticed he had an Orkane on his head. Oh, yeah, nice. <laughs> uh, I think only Orkanes do that, but they, they're like the only ones that can do that yeah. with the way the stuff like He's a that. very stable uh, yeah. flush. Exactly. Though you could do it with Edelus, the other four-legged flush. You could. Oh, we have a bunch of flushes now, I forgot. So we have Sylvanas. Are those only characters with four legs? Um, May no. Maple? 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 I mean, she runs on four legs. Yeah. She's not like she's trucking, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> she's not, she's not I'm just picture her like back. swiveling. Oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> So yeah, see, she's like four-legged. You remember, have you seen that, that the art like of the ripped maple that Elrano drew? She's like yes. so, so yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, that's what I think of. That was, <laughs> running that's, at you? That's football maple. <laughs> <laughs> Coming to a sting near you. <laughs> Workshop, please, someone. All right, Rot is trying to get off this edge, jumping around. Oh, and I think, yeah, Rot really likes the stage, too. Probably got banned uh, in the strikings. Yeah. This is, um, I think even though it's funny because it's his stage, it's just, I think it's very good for Sylvanas. Yeah. Those platforms are great for him to hide under from projectiles. Not for long. I but we will, like, important to know that, Ooh. man, uh, Starbucks is not afraid to use uh, bubbles at all. And that's really good. I yeah. think some people that like, get to their head, like, you know, bubble camping or bubble spammer, they don't want, like, that tag or label attached to them. But if it's, if it's good in the matchup, just utilize it. Yeah. 
The oh, other thing man. you see too it's is people not adjust. Like, oh, they play people and they get like their bubbles paired or something, so they just don't bubble anymore. Exactly. But you should do it. Why well, you can get away with it? I totally agree. That's like the number one advice I give to or game players. It's like, listen, keep them honest. Like, see if just they, they see can. if they are good. Yeah. At it. <laughs> if not, then punish them. Nice. So once again. Uh, Starbus is able to close out the stock. Rot's not. He's going for these edge guards that maybe might, you know, might not be helping him. Right. Uh, he's highly committal. Like there was a dash attack, which I'm not sure. I mean, maybe it would have killed if it, hit, if it hit the sweet spot. But other times he was like jumping off stage and trying to flower him from above. I think you should just strike Arcane. You know, he has a couple mix-ups falling down, but yeah. you should be able to snipe him with his up air either way. I mean, it's kind of shown too. Every kill, I think, I want to say oh. every kill he's gotten this set so far has been an up air. Uh, right, exactly. Right, yeah. So exactly. like, just keep, just keep doing it. Exactly. And Don't that try was to get a, fancy. That was a great like, I mean, however many, how much percent he gained, we got on. Uh, Rot did a lot. Got like 80 percent, just a, a string and then an edge guard. So oh, oh, the sweet spot. But did he tech it? I think he just ended up uh, being oh. so far that he slid a little bit. Oh okay. I missed. I was I was only looking at Rot to see if he would recover afterwards. Oh, he would have had the timing with the bite. Just went a little low. Wow. Ooh, that little bit of grass up top. Yeah, got him. That was cool. I think Arash should be going for more kill options eventually. I mean, yeah, I mean kind of the same way Star Starbos is. Look, Starbos is just like, oh, I'm going to, he's, he's a kill percent. I'm going to down strong. I'm going to up strong him. Yeah. And that's kind of how he's gotten a few kills. I haven't seen Rot do the same with down strong. Yeah, Sylvanas is a heavy. His smashes are all good. Well, I wouldn't say that. Uh, they're I mean, all, in terms they're of all like going to kill you. Sorry. They're yeah, all going to kill, kill you. But then it's not, yeah, you can't really fish for him as much. So maybe he likes confirms more, you know. Maybe he likes to see the, the down air dra or the near da drag down into the, the down strong. That's fair. And look at this combo, man. Oh. <laughs> 70, 60 percent off one combo. Yeah. That was what we need to see. That was nice. And he, I mean, I think he does that. Oh, and he interrupts his uh. Edge guard or his recovery. Oh wow! All right, it. Great, like just patience and like knowing that he's gonna, he's been using it a lot. Just wait for him to do it. Good stuff on Starbus. Wow, that was cool. You get to see a prime example of Savannah's range there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just waxing with the fair. Oh man, going for another down tilt. Oh, okay. I thought he was gonna get the parry in the bubbles, but Starbus gets the parry on the on the owl. Yeah, he was waiting oh. for it. First bite we've seen. Is he gonna? Okay, good. He at least went for the up airs, but that was great recovery, like momentum shift from Starbus. But nice. there he is, catching him again. Gets the up air. Pop off. Well deserved after losing the first stock. Now, game three. We got the good strikes? sets. Good sets. The, yeah, this is great. He knew exactly what he wanted to strike too. Okay. FD. Honestly, I like it for both characters. Why do you start with a with the howl? I don't know. What I was kind of like a exhibition move, but. <laughs> oh man, Starbus. Okay. Oh. Okay. Luckily, oh no, he thought he was gonna come back that way. No, yeah, he wasn't, wasn't paying enough attention. Starbus tries to get the read, doesn't. Wow, barely doesn't connect. Fast fall on that is so cool. You change your momentum like so quickly. Yeah, that was really good. Sneaky. Wow. He is playing with Death Store. Well, I mean, Starbus is just not letting up the pressure. Yeah. Um, he's he's honestly doing really well. Do something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the down air? He went all the way through. He gets wow. away with it again. I think wow. he's just Wait, what do you mean? avoiding death so many times. What do you mean? It's just like a it's just like a mix up where he goes, right? It oh, that's it. The back here. Man. Are, you, are you listening to like the announcer or something? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you stop. Okay. <laughs> I stopped in the middle of sentence. Yeah. I was like, you're right. <laughs> when you were like, <laughs> <laughs> when you were just okay, like, I'm sorry, he's sorry, sorry. Back to the back. Back to the back. <laughs> so, Ra has not let him take too much of a lead. Up smash right there. No, that's not. Yes. That's smash not, attack I don't M. think it has that much. It does. That much hit stun. I Look, he did it there and it, he died. He did that. You're right. Okay, so pretty much an even game. Rob was able to close it out before it got too crazy. But Starbo's coming back strong. Wow. Wow. Yeah, are you kidding me? A really, that really was great conversion. Uh, a whole stock up now. Let's if if Rob wants to bring this back, he has to, he has to one touch up his edge guards. He has to okay. maybe get a down air. Uh, for the spike for an early one, but just in general, I think he's maybe not this game necessarily, but he, in general, he's winning neutral enough and he's able to get Orke in such an, a position where. Oh, he does go all the way out! Wow, that was disgusting. Yeah, well done. The fist up. 
Starbus making it to winners finals of the pool.